Hey guys, it's me, Mario. And today we're going to uh, read the prologue of Rashuk the Cave Troll. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are doing well. Sorry this video is a bit late, I, <clears throat> I got caught up and distracted with some stuff. But hey, at least it's going out today, <laughs> and not next week. So yeah. <coughs> Rashuk, the Cave Troll Prologue <clears throat> The cave was stuffy and airless, and the way ahead was blocked by a wall of stone. Friend tapped his cousin, Bray, Blay, on the shoulder. It's a dead end, he said. We should leave. We must find the coal, Blay replied. Winter will soon be upon us, and I won't have my family going cold. Excuse me. We held his... He held his small flaming torch aloft as he tapped at the wall with his pickaxe. His hollow... It's hollow, Blay said, smiling. We can smash our way through. We'd be crossing over to the Forbidden Land, said friend fearfully. Blaze snorted. I don't believe those stories about the Forbidden Land. He slipped his torch into a crevice in the cave's wall. Besides, there might be coal on the other side. Blaze hacked at the wall, and friend helped. Despite his own fears, he and Blay swung their pickaxes with matching grunts that echoed off the cave walls like flung pebbles. Within moments, they were on the other side. Friend picked up Blay's torch and cast light over the new area. Still, no coal. He grow, he growled. Blay opened his mouth to reply, but his voice was drowned out by a fearsome thudding sound that made the ground vibrate beneath their feet. We should leave, friend shouted, as the thundering grew louder. There was a familiar rhythm to it now. Footsteps. From out of the shadows came a creature more terrifying than anything Fren had ever laid eyes on. The beast was twice as tall as a man, and five times as wide, his shoulders scraping along the cave walls. Fren recognized the creature, but only from old stories he had a thought were fantasy. A troll, he he cried, stumbling backwards as the beast pounded towards them, his yellow teeth bared. Friend could see that the troll's hands were the size of large shades, spades, and that the fingers on his right hand had Long, jagged, yellow nails. Run! He shouted to Blay, but Blay did not move. This wretched beast won't stop me finding coal, he yelled back, raising his pickaxe. The troll bore down on Blay, his heavy feet leaving deep cra craters in the ground with, with every step. By the light of the torch, Fren 
could see the beast's large drooping ears and sunken eyes, pushing to the edges of his face by a wide nose that appeared a appeared to quiver as the beast sniffed the air. And here is Rashuk. Blay gave a roar and charged straight at the hideous creature. The beast met him head on and swiped his right arm down, slashing at Blay with his sharp nails. Friend screamed a uh, warning, but Blay made no sound at all. Instead, he stood completely still. Friend gave a wail of fear and despair as he saw his cousin's skin darken to the color of slate, and his body became stiff. Blay had been turned to stone. With a sob, Friend fled back towards the mouth of the cave. Behind him, he could hear thundering footsteps and eager sniffing, telling him that the troll was close. He heard a swoosh behind him as the beast swiped down with his claws again. Friend felt no pain as his body froze. There was only the cold before everything went dark. And that was the prologue of Rashuk. The cave troll. <laughs> well, I forgot about that prologue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Two people went into a cave to find the coal. They broke into the forbidden, the underground of the forbidden land and found Rashuk. <laughs> Instead of coal, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was, uh, an interesting reread. But yeah. <laughs> I'm making this a bit late today because I... Watched my uh, niece today. I played games with her and had a good time with her today, so. I did that instead of doing this video earlier, so. That's why it's a bit later. <laughs> but yeah. Hope you like, subscribe, don't rem don't mind my nephew. <laughs> Don't mind my nephew laughing. <laughs> Hope you like, subscribe, and hit the bell if you guys are interested in more Beast Quest. Alright. Bye bye. Um, I've, I never know how to end these things. But pff, that's YouTube for you, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything. Barely know anything. I'm just talking so easy to get this video to nine minutes. Ah, there we go. Alright, see you guys in the next video. On Tuesday. Bye bye.